Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. INS Delhi with pennant number D61 is the lead ship of her class of guided missile destroyers of the Indian Navy. She was built at Musgaon Dock Limited in Mumbai and commissioned on 15th November 1997. This class was among the largest warship to be designed and built in India at the time of her commissioning. As many of you would be aware that the ship was undergoing mid-life upgrades from 2018 and now she's back in service with sensors upgraded and new modular launcher for Brahmos missile as a replacement of KH-35E missiles. The destroyer is back with a bang after its middle launch of Brahmos missile. The test was carried out from the ship on 19th April 2022. Yesterday, we have also reported regarding the test firing of Brahmos from a Su-30 MKI. The successful middle launch of Brahmos firing by INS Delhi is the seventh test of Brahmos missile conducted this year by India. Interestingly, India tested two Brahmos launches on April 19th. The test of Brahmos from an upgraded model launcher has once again proved the long-range strike capability of Brahmos along with validation of integrated network-centric operation from the frontline platforms. In the recent pictures of INS Delhi released by Indian Navy, we can clearly see the shining and new blazing launcher tubes after the midlife refit. However, the launch trajectory of Brahmos was different from what we have seen usually. The missile used to launch vertically first, followed by 90 degree sharp turn, whereas the one fired from INS Delhi has a rising inclined trajectory. This is because of the new launcher of INS Delhi. The existing 16 KH-35E Uran missile launchers used in INS Delhi are quadrupled sloped launchers, which have been now replaced with eight Brahmos launchers. However, they are still sloped launchers rather than VLS batteries. The destroyer does have a VLS battery, which is equipped with 16 Barak-1 missiles. The Delhi-class destroyers are the guided missile destroyers of Indian Navy. Three ships of this class are in active service which are INS Delhi, INS Mumbai and INS Mysur. INS Delhi along with Nilgiri-class frigate will form the battle group for IC Vikrant to be commissioned in August. The three Delhi-class guided missile destroyers would be re-based in Vishakhapatnam from Western Command. INS Mysur is also undergoing refit as of now. The midlife refit of Delhi class destroyers include the upgrades for several weapons and sensors. The KH-35E Uran missiles will be replaced by Brahmos missiles. The still one air defense system will replace the 9K-90 Urgan with Frigate M2EM radar replacing Frigate MAE. The Kite Sreech fire control system of AK-100 will be replaced by BEL Lynx U2. The electronics warfare system will be upgraded to Elora MK2 with coverage decoy launchers. The Atlas electronic ACTS towed array sonar will be installed on all the three ships. The destroyer is powered by two Ukrainian Zoria mass procate M36E engines. The destroyer has a displacement of 6,200 tons. Apart from Brahmos for surface attack and Barak 1 for air defense, the destroyer is equipped with two still SAM system which includes 48 missiles, 100mm AK-100 gun, two 30mm AK-630 Gatling guns and four of them in INS Mumbai, two RBU-6000 rocket launchers, quintuple 533mm torpedo tubes and two rails of depth charges. It can also host two sinking MK-42B helicopters. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.